Hong Kong is the world's brightest city. Its most recognizable sight is its skyline, a dazzling exhibition of light. And yet, behind all of the flashing lights is a massive environmental issue, light pollution. So my research uh, is the measurement of how bright or how dark the sky in Hong Kong is. We have an uh, instrument to measure the brightness of the light sky. Basically, we are measuring uh, the scatter light from the ground. Light pollution affects a number of different aspects. For, uh, for me, I'm an astronomer, so one of the consequences is the decrease of brightness contrast of the light sky. That means uh, we hardly see many stars in Hong Kong nowadays, just because the sky is bright by the light pollution. Light pollution's most obvious effect is that it, it obscures stars. However, this issue can also have large effects on the health of many organisms, including us. As you may know, we live, we need a darkness for sleeping or for rest. Our bodies used to be uh, have a light and daylight cycle for normal health. Once the daylight cycle is uh, affect, we, we may have a uh, bad health. Many plants and animals spent millennia adapting to the day-night cycle, and not being able to differentiate between the two can have catastrophic consequences. For example, uh, if uh, we have uh, many bites of sweet plants in the countryside area, say, uh, many elderly animals can't get used to that kind of light. They use the darkness for rest or for hunting moving. For example, some birds will hit the gas wall of the building just because the wall are illuminated too bright for them. So they lost the direction and just hit to the, uh, uh, to the gas wall and die. And other example is the uh, insect, about insect. There is an uh, insect uh, unique in Hong Kong. Uh, it's a firefly unique in Hong Kong. And some research find that uh, their living habitat is affected just because of light pollution. Because, because they use to uh, emit light uh, when the ambient uh, light ambient environment is dark enough. So uh, for plants, uh, maybe you know for the synthesis, it also leads a daylight cycle. In at daytime, the the, the trees and the plants. Can have a uh, normal photosynthesis. But if we install many light instruments uh, around them, they may, uh, they, they, the plants can't distinguish light from the uh, uh, day from the light. So they have normal photosynthesis cycle effect. You know, just one component in the food chain is destroyed, it will affect the whole biosphere. So, what can we do? Obviously, we can't turn off all our lights, that would be unreasonable. However, there are ways that this issue can be improved. I, what I'm going to say is that we use the light wisely, don't abuse the light. Uh, for outdoor lighting, for example, you see, you see many street lamps in Hong Kong, everyone has a lamp post, and they in, uh, make the road very bright. However, uh, you, you can take a look. You can take a look at the lamp pole. Most of the lamp pole don't have a shielding. A shielding, the shield. The, the shield acts as a, a, a protector to prevent the light going up. You know the the purpose. The, the purpose of this lamp pole is to light up the ground, right? But not the sky. However. If we have a bad shielding design, most of the light will go up instead of down. So one of the solutions to reduce light pollution is to have a better shielding. One more example is we can switch off the lights when they are not in use. It's simple. 
if you go out of room, just turn off the light, it makes sense. But uh, uh, it's not uncommon to find many examples that many lights still turn on after midnight. Uh, uh, for instance, you, 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 if you go to Hong Kong and Central uh, shopping mall, the, the front door of many business store still turn, be, turn on their lights after the business hour, just for attracting eyeball. Living in an urban city, we have forgotten what true darkness really looks like. Gone are the days when you could stare up at the sky and see the Milky Way. But we can still make a change to this, one light at a time.